This past Monday, Hopkinton JV Girls Soccer kicked off a doubleheader of games versus Ashland. It was a scoreless game all the way until two minutes left in the third quarter, where Ashland scored to make it one to nothing. By Graziano. For Ashland is Friedman. Into the box. Set back to the goaltender, and no, it's going to end up being a goal. Shortly after the Hillers responded, Nina Brooks evened up the game. That was a pretty good boot there by Van Buren. On the side, here comes Sansonetti sending it down, looking for Hayward. Aired out, out in front, and that is in! What a beauty of a goal! Nina Brooks off the pass from Sansonetti makes it one to one. Hopkinton and Ashland JV ended in a one to one draw. In the varsity game, Ashland scored a nice goal with 11 minutes left in the second quarter to make it one to nothing. Maddie English on the free kick. Here's it out. That's a goal. Oh, that's in. What a beauty by Maddie English to make it a 1 0 Ashland lead. Great goal. Well struck. Shortly after, Ava Perlov set up Joanna DuPont for a goal. Veal. Veal. And here comes Perlov. Takes a shot and just with that's head, it. and it's put in. Great. Great shot from DuPont. Then a few minutes later, the Hillers added yet another. Gabriella Siri set up Lexi Trendle to make it two to one. Gabriella Siri. This is a perfect time for a shot. Siri. Oh, great play. And that is in. So Siri put it no. towards the net, yep. and then it looks like it went off of Trendle. Yep, it was. Two to one in the third quarter, and Gabriella Siri finds Joanna DuPont on a beauty of a free kick. She might go all the way to the net with this, you never know. Nice one out in front. Nice DuPont shot with DuPont. a goal! Well taken. That's the second goal of the day for DuPont. The Hillers would win by that 3-1 to one score and improve to four wins, one loss, and two ties on the season. On Tuesday, November 3rd, Hillers JV Field Hockey kicked off a triple header of Hillers games. Ashland would score the lone goal in the second quarter. Playing some nice defense today. Here comes Ashland. Good stop there. Into the box, looking for a shot, and there's a goal. Wow. That was a nice pass right in front for Sophie Porter to lace it in. And that's how the score would stand. Ashland wins a good defensive battle, one to nothing. In game two of the triple header, Hiller's varsity field hockey celebrated senior night before they took on Ashland. Here's a look. Once again, number one, Bonnie Schaller, her parents, Shimon, and Bobby. 
Shortly into the game, the Hillers made some noise. Alyssa Souza rips in a goal to make it a one to nothing Hillers lead. Megan White and Olivia Mingase, Hillers alum on the call. Another senior Halloween costume dress up yesterday. Yeah, they did a few laps around the track outside. Oh, who was yeah, that, Alyssa? Yeah, five minutes. Was it was Alyssa? Yeah, we I think to, so. We had to write that. Yeah, you got it. Shortly into the second quarter, freshman Camille Perlov finds junior Avery Hutchinson to make it a 2 to nothing game. The Hillers took the win over Ashland 3-1. In the finale of the triple header this past Tuesday, Hopkinton boys varsity soccer took on Ashland. In the second quarter, Owen Schnur finds Colin Davin off a free kick. Declan Mick on the ball. He's going to touch it to Andrew Gunn, who drives it forward. Schnoor's going to get on the end of this, controls it. He's got men on him. Nice Plays layoff. It to, oh, this could be a great, yeah. Good, nice shot. <laughs> Goal! <laughs> that, was an, that was an error on the keeper. He was there. It's, he just it went through his hands. Ashland later on would have a goal of their own, and it would end in a one-to-one -one final. It was another great week of Hiller Sports versus their arch nemesis clockers. Field hockey and soccer will be back in action this coming weekend against Bellingham.